What's up guys, my name is Dale, a fitness and bodywork specialist out here in Southern California. We are back with Ariel, who has some sciatic pain that she wants me to take a look at. Um, how long has this sciatic pain been bothering you? Uh, for a couple years now, so. Years? Years. Oh, okay, so usually sciatic pain comes from tightness in the glutes um, going down to your hamstrings into your foot. So I'm gonna do um, a glute release, hamstring release, and then probably go down to her calf and foot to see if we have enough time for that. Yeah, sounds painful. You ready? Ready for okay. it. Okay. Men of culture. Is it slang for something? Did you hear that? You're getting old. I know. <laughs> okay, so glutes first. We'll do, okay. it's on your left or right? It's actually on my left. You put it to your right, <laughs> like straight. Okay. Okay, let's test, test. hamstrings first. And calf. Tight. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Bend. Bending. Oh my god. Okay, I'm trying my best. You don't need to do anything, just relax. Okay, I'm gonna relax. I'm okay. Relaxing. Where do you feel the stretch? Should I actually feel it. In the in crease my, of your leg? No, I feel a lot in my quad. Your quad. Whoa. Your quad? Yeah. It's not supposed to be. <laughs> it should be like okay, glute yeah. hamstring. Now I feel in my glute and hamstring, but also my quad. The other one was more quad for some reason. Oh. Okay, we're gonna do glute. I'm gonna turn your leg. Hopefully it turns. And I'm gonna it's get really turn. close to you. Okay. Okay. Ready? Oh, so close. <laughs> <laughs> This should be glute if it's, it's the crease. This is definitely 100% glute. Okay. <laughs> so close. So close to oh, me. Oh. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Oh, do I smell like Chick-fil-A? <laughs> Chick-fil-A? Yeah, I just had it this morning. What'd you have? Breakfast? Mm hmm Or lunch? Like a biscuit. Chicken biscuit. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. What sauce do you get though? The Chick-fil-A sauce though. Okay, relax. Deep breath, exhale. Maybe that's what it means, men of culture. Maybe it's like... That's like, been bothering you for yeah, weeks. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Maybe it means like, like culture, like Chick-fil-A culture. Like what kind of culture are we talking about? Like, like the Christian culture? church. <laughs> Isn't that what Chick-fil-A is? They're, aren't they Christian? I, I don't know. The food is magical, so I don't doubt it. I want a chicken sandwich now. But I don't know, we should, let's ask the people. What does men of culture mean? Comment below. We don't know what it means. <laughs> is it slang for I feel something? old. I know. You guys, I'm going to be so disappointed if they're going to, they just like make fun of me. It's just men of culture. We're here to make fun of her. We to say that. Well, that's why I don't read the comments. Only in that last video. I know. <laughs> well, we could start reading the comments. Maybe they'll tell us. Tell us. <laughs> <laughs> no. It's just opening up a can of worms that I don't want to go down. Relax, but, relax, relax. I can't relax. It hurts. Okay, okay, I'm relaxing. Okay. Okay. Let's get to the serious stuff. That was not serious? Nope. That felt serious. Push into my shoulder. Three, two, one, relax. Okay. Push. Three, two, one, relax. Uh, you know, I don't like when I relax because you push it forward. I don't push it. Okay. It's your body releasing itself. Push. Okay. Three, two, one. One, relax. Uh, Good job. Hold uh, the stretch, hold the stretch. A little shaky. Oh, that's uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> this must sound weird. The sound effects. The sound effects. Push into my shoulder. Three, two, one, relax. And push. Three, two, one, uh, relax. Relax, uh, chill, 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 chill. Okay, chill. I'm trying. Ooh, it's really, really, really painful. Oh my gosh. Okay. Good. Team. <laughs> oh. Okay, let's get you on to this side. So roll and face that way. Okay, roll and face that way. Legs straight. Oh. Hold on one second. Oh. China. Men of culture. Ooh. Sorry. See, some of them are really nice. Can you scoot towards me just a little bit? So oh, hold on, I'm trying to focus on reading people's comments. It should be easier as okay. you. Is that is that better? There you go. Cool. Okay. Oh, oh, this again. Oh. Yeah, because oh. someone be sitting too much. I know. I you work too much. I know. I actually, can I tell you something crazy? Hmm. 
so I was in Arizona all this past week. And then, so this upcoming week, Monday I'm here, Tuesday I am have to drive to LA, Wednesday I'm driving to San Diego, Thursday, so yeah, listen, Thursday I have to do a day trip to San Jose. On, day oh, trip? Yeah, so. There and back? Yeah, 6 a.m. flight there, and oh, then like fly. 9 p.m. flight back. And then Friday back to LA. Why so busy? I don't know. Gotta make that money. Gotta make that money. Ow. I don't have like a rich husband or anything. Damn. Do you think the men of culture will give me a rich husband? They might. Please. Please. <laughs> they actually might. I beg of you. Oh. I beg of you. <laughs> Fund my Chick fil A. Fund my Chick fil A passion. Ow. All right. Let's hear a comment. Okay. From the men of culture. Okay, the men of culture. I forgot how many pauses I made on this video to internalize the stretching. Oh, that's good. You're affecting them. <laughs> He's really learning. Oh, I cannot watch the cupping, but she is a true goddess and I want to adore her. Do you think he's rich? <laughs> oh no okay now you got now we have to establish what is rich to you what is an acceptable oh. income here we go a, an acceptable income here we go i don't know like i don't have a set income that i'm thinking of but i feel like someone who's like comfortable they have a good job and then a lamborghini oh, i mean it wouldn't hurt to <laughs> have a Lamborghini, but um, I mean, that would be nice, yeah. But that's like, I mean, I just, I honestly just, I feel like someone is rich when they're like, they're comfortable, they have everything that they need, and um, ah, it's not a money thing, it's a status thing, as, yeah. You well, know look I mean. at you, I know. there you go, because I feel like I've met a lot of people who are financially well off financially well but then just have this broke mentality like they're not generous people Yo. they like hoard and they're just i don't know unreasonable with things so i've actually met quite a lot of people like that i actually read that recently like um I think like it's a mentality. Wealth, wealth is a mentality yeah yeah I, I actually agree with that because the the example that they gave up is like the lottery winners there's a good percentage of lottery winners that go broke right right so it's like you have all the money in the world but how do you still go broke oh exactly no exactly so even though it was a joke in the beginning where i was like i want a rich husband but um in reality i do i guess generous right generous. would be a better word for that because like i said i've met some people who are who have money and are well off but they're not generous people and they're actually those type of people that like if we go to dinner and they're like well i'm like do you want to split the bill or do you want me to cover it and they're like well we should just split it but you got a coke so you need to pay an extra dollars. oh nickel and dime yeah for a coke? you know what i mean men of culture don't do that men of culture i'm really gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna google that today <laughs> i'm gonna i'm gonna reddit it red no no <laughs> Oh, no? I don't know. Reddit scares me. Really? I feel like Reddit's like the best source of information. Every time I have a question, I'm like... You ask Reddit? Yes, of course. The men of culture for sure are on Reddit. You think so? Yeah. Cool. Do you think I could be a part of the men of culture? No. That would be like the women, women men of culture. The society of culture. You would be the goddess, remember? Oh, oh yes. <laughs> That's true. You'd be their goddess. Oh, no. The comments, they let, they closed... We were getting philosophical while you're rubbing on my bum. Men of culture. Okay. Let's see what else. It's, ooh. Oh, speaking of bum, it says very quote unquote well rounded client. And whatever she decides to do, I stand behind her. That's so nice. These men of culture are so nice. I'm going to put a star. <laughs>